planned a rafting trip, and we went down to the Akoli. And uh, my baby was concerned. I said, no, but she was concerned. She was concerned. We got down there. Check this out. We get down there. We go down the Akoli, and it's rough. And there's this one drop off. Everybody that went down through there were flipping their wraps. Everybody. Did I say everybody? Everybody. everybody. And we had this little girl back there who's our guide. She wasn't that tall, five foot. A little stocky little thing. And then and, and, uh, we, we, we came all the way down the corner, and right at the end, there's this big drop off. It just, boom, and it, it comes back up on the other side and throws everybody out. How about we went through it? No problem. Jumped it, come up on the other side, and nobody fell out of that rap. Because they got they take pictures up here and all that kind of stuff. And um, and when we got done with the, the rafting trip, the person most concerned <laughs> said, Where can we find another one? We need one bigger than this. <laughs> and they're like, they're like, what? She conquered. Yeah, that's right. And realize, oh, it, this ain't all of that. Right. We need one bigger than this. Start asking the lady, what can we find one in the country bigger than this? Mm -hmm. She said, the lady said, well, the only thing I know, you need to go down to, uh, to the Colorado. And so we, she started checking out the Colorado River. Yeah. See, we, she needed a big one because that was nothing to her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but my point, my point in bringing up that story is once you experience what you realize is, that the fear of it, it wasn't all of it. Right, right. And sometimes the devil would talk you out of stuff. Yeah. Victories yeah. that you could have had. Yeah. That watch this, watch this, the pressure or the, the pressing and getting to that victory. Once you uh, uh, overcome it and strive, you know, to get there, you realize, man, that wasn't that wasn't that bad. Yeah. Right. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. So you, yes, you can. You can yeah. overcome. You can overcome any fear that the enemy try to throw in your face. Yeah. Amen. Amen. For God not give us a spirit of timidity, of cowardice, or craving, or cringing, and fawning fear, but He has, watch this, has given us a spirit of power, and of love, yes. of a calm, well balanced mind, well balanced mind, yes. and discipline and self control. Why? Why? Why mind? Why did he give us a well-balanced mind? Because that's where fear starts. Yes. It's how you see it. Huh? It's how you see it. Uh, uh, whatever's going on in your life, you don't have to do major cover-ups. Because if somebody finds out about it, so what? They just might be the one to help you. Amen. Amen.